So what's up guys, GP30 Foamer here, and we're back on the holy <laughs> southern. Or are we? So, uh, recently, and by recently, I mean like five hours ago, I got an idea. So I was re-watching a bunch of Heiss's old Railroads Online videos, and one in particular caught my interest. It was the episode in which he bought his, uh, 818C for the ESND, number two, POTUS, and ran it up a line which was basically a ripoff of the Georgetown Loop. And I got bored and I was feeling nostalgic. So I recreated the loop from the ground up, from nothing but that video. I've taken my own artistic freedom on, on the loop. And done a few things differently uh, because of how the game is now. Yeah, because of how the game is now, some parts had to be laid completely differently and yeah, and that's a bit of an issue. So today we're going to run a train with the exact same consists as in that video, but with our own engine, number three, loose. And we're going to run it exactly how Heist ran it. And I've got the settings, I've got the physics on realistic mode, so we're gonna have to double the hill. So, let's do it. Yeah, so right off the bat, I had to do a little bit of uh, artistic liberty because uh, my sawmill is set up a lot differently from how Heist's sawmill is set up. Come on, girl. You got this. So yeah, I've had to do a little bit of tweaking to get this section of the track to work. But after this, it's almost a... It is almost a perfect recreation. There's still some stuff I have to do to make it a fully biblically accurate recreation. Come on. Come on, you've got this. Just gonna go on the map real quick and line us into the siding so we can drop the train off. So my main goal for this episode is to get a recreation of the shot. You know the shot I'm talking about. The shot that was used in almost all of his livestream thumbnails. You know the shot. So yeah, that's my main goal for this. To get that shot. Yep. Okay, so... Uh, here we go. We're almost at the siding. I think while we're here, I'm also gonna stop and take on water and give y'all a preview of what the loop looks like. <laughs> now that's a bit of a steep bit. Come on. Come on. You've got this. You've got this. Whew. We barely made it, but we did.
All right, here we are coming up to the siding. Oh, I should have listened to the stop signal. No. Okay, we're stopped. Again, this isn't a perfect 100% accurate recreation. There's... I said a couple of things, but in reality, there's a bunch of things I have to tweak. Like, the siding could be a bit more, like, up close to the edge. Well, not up close to the edge, like, up close to the side of the mountain. And the water tank it's on a foundation of wall, not uh, uh, sits on a foundation of wall, not just straight groundwork. And okay, here we go. Perfect. You know, I love how the water tower, like, snaps to the track now. That's such a cool feature. It, it saves me the effort. It saves me the hassle of having to line it up all, all over again. Oof. That was stressful. Yeah, and here's a preview of the loop. Oh god, and we've uh, fallen off. Uh, good thing we can reach pretty far. Here's a preview of the loop in all of its glory. Yeah, again, I had to uh, extend this all the way back here because of how track laying works now. Yeah, this was the only spot with a uh, wide enough valley radius for me to do a good curve and I've had to do that a lot to get to get it to how I want it, how it looked. I'm going to get rid of the crosshair again. Yep. Just going to line the switch back. Okay. You know, it's kind of surreal being on this alignment, like, so many years after it was built. Like, why, do I, why am I even saying so many? It's, it's only been two or three. Like, no, it's been, like, I'm going to say, like, just under three years since this line was built. How is it possible to be so nostalgic over something that's not even three years old. How is that possible? Nostalgia is a strange thing. Sorry, I'm rambling again. This is a very impromptu thing that I just wanted to do for the hell of it. And 3,800, there we go. We're all full of water. Dunk. And now we're going to head back down and double the hill.
And you know, honestly, I also got this idea after watching Jersey's recent Twitch stream in which he discovered the, old, the actual old save file for the ESD. I'd highly re recommend like watching that stream and just and just uh, following Jersey in general. He's he's a genuinely great guy and pretty funny too. Anyways, that stream and just that stream inspired me to do this as well as just rewatching all the old videos. It's nice to have an actual bit of the original ESD on my save. I'd love to try and like, re I'd love to try and make a full one-to-one -one recreation of the map because I don't know if the actual original save file is still out there somewhere publicly. I, I really hope it is. But I understand if it isn't, so the next best thing is to bring a section of it home. You know, I've wanted to play this game pretty much since I'd say the month it came out because uh, I'd heard about it in passing on a Discord conversation somewhere and decided to look it up and the first video I found on the subject was was Khan's first video of it. Like, I don't think it was even two days old by the time I found it. I didn't have my uh, gaming laptop at the time, so yeah. so I wasn't able to play. And it was through Khan that I actually found out about heists and the old ESMD. So I've pretty much, like, been in the know for almost three years at this point. Say almost three years. Yeah. Alright, now we gotta take this lot up to reattach with the rest of the train. Right, here we go. I wouldn't say I've been in the know about this game since day one, but I've pretty much been in the know since since that first con video. That first video got me hooked on this game, and I wanted to play it so badly. for a while it was actually my dream to be in one of those map showcase streams that Heist did. Sadly, uh, he's moved on from the game and moved on to Century of Steam now, which I'd also love to get that game when it comes out. Sorry, I'm just rambling. It's it's 10:30 when I'm filming this. That's how impromptu this thing is. That's how impromptu this video is. And when I'm tired, I tend not to think straight. I mean, I tend not to think straight in general. So uh, yeah, that's something. So yeah, we're uh, almost. We're almost uh, at the siding again, where we can rejoin. We can uh, rejoin the train and take it down the loop. God, that that bit is so steep. Oh my god! Don't even know what caused that. But I'm also gonna have to fix that. 
Yeah, there's a few blips on this recreation I'm gonna have to fix. I'm pretty sure I've said that like at least a gazillion times. Right, and here we are. apply at least 40% of brakes just like in the video yeah I'm just trying so hard to get that nostalgic feeling back you know I really do miss the old days of the old days of caboose races in Kenosha's Days. And that's what I'm trying, I'm trying to recreate them here, you know? <sighs> Nostalgia is a powerful thing. Oh, again, me not thinking straight. I coupled and then decoupled. I think I said it before, I don't, I don't know, my uh, train of thought is far off the rails, but yeah, I think I've said it before, but it's just so surreal being on, like, even though it's not the actual save, it's just so surreal being on a part of this legendary virtual railroad. Yeah, this railroad is absolutely legendary. Come on, come on, come on, Lucy, you got this. Oh God, Are we stuck. Nope, she she's got it. Come on, come on, you've got this. Woo. Come on, yes, good. You've got this, Lucy. I believe in you. Bell, come on, Bell increases tractive effort, come on, yes, it's working, yes, yes, <laughs> we're doing it, come on, back it up, back it up, back it up, Whew. okay, working, it's working, yes, come on, come on, Xander, come on, Please, come on, no. <laughs> God. Yeah, we're gonna try and, uh, do that thing. Now! Come on. Yeah, I don't know exactly what this move is called, but... But... God, I don't know. Sorry. I'm losing my train of thought. I've been losing it for a while. know trying to do that that one move where you apply the brakes on the last car drift down and then just throw it in reverse trying to do that but backwards and it it's actually working it's working trying to do that move but backwards 
spell. Spell increases attractive effort. Yes, we're doing it. We're doing it. We're almost there. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know exactly what the move is called. But it actually worked. Holy crap, that... I'm genuinely surprised that that actually worked. Like, especially considering how lackluster it was, I'm genuinely surprised it actually worked. Don't... Are we coupled? Yes, we are. Okay. Here we go. We're heading down the loop. find a way to patch that bug. Oh god, here we go, down the loop. Really should have dropped the save up there. But, here we go. Down the loop we go. And again, my, my one goal for this video is to get the shot. The shot. You know which shot I'm talking about. Oh god. Brakes. 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 Okay, kick him off. Okay, here we go. Why? Brakes. Okay, we're breaking, breaking, I think we're going to stop it here, just to get the shot. Oh, here it is, here it is. Break, stop, 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 here, here it is, here it is, here's the shot, here's the shot. Okay, I'm going to wait for the stupid tool tip to get out of the way. There it is, and... We got it. We got the shot. We did it. It's still just so insane that I'm actually able to do this right now. I'm still just still not comprehending it. turn right about here and trust me I've tried to do it right about here but uh, it hasn't really worked out yeah it didn't really uh, work out because of how the splines are now I can't go less than 30 meters I don't know if it was like I can't go less than a 30 meter radius I don't know if it was like that in the old saying in, on the old splines, but yeah, it can't be less than 30 meters, so uh, I've had to make the turn here.
because this is the only part of the valley that actually has a wide enough area for me to view the turn. And now we're on our way back down. Oh, okay, here we go. I, I really hope we can actually clear going through the bridge. I don't know if we're actually going to be able to clear it. There's a train! Oh, oh, oh god, stop, 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 Oh, Jesus! Thought I got all of them, but evidently not. Whew! That scared the ever living crap out of me. Heard of that again? At least the brakes. Okay, now we're on our way back down again. Yeah, I, I have the feeling that uh, we can't take any really big engines down here, so I don't know if we're going to be able to get, get King or any of those engines down here. I mean, we might if we're absolutely extra special careful. But this is the part that I'm worried about right here. Because that bridge support ain't looking too nice. Okay, we're, we're passing. Didn't have to worry about it at all. Uh -huh. Okay, now we're to the uh, last downhill straight, pretty much. And this is the other part where I've had to take some artistic liberty, because uh, my smelter is set up way different from how Heist's smelter was, so... Uh, yeah, I've had to... Uh, some artistic liberty, and I think now will be a good time to slam on the brakes. Oh no 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 no! Oh no 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 no! Oh god! Oh god! Down we go! Oh god! Oh god! Well, that's gone poorly. Oh god! Okay. Yeah, I think in the next episode we're gonna take this lot up to the, uh, up to the iron mine. But yeah, that was it. That was my recreation of the each dies Georgetown loop I still can't believe we just did that holy crap just going to uh, line this switch again I'm gonna come to a stop right about here Yeah, we did it. We cr we recreated a section of the each and die. We I I still can't believe we actually did that. Again, I know it's not 100% biblically accurate, but I'm still so proud of how it came out. So yeah, that was it. Thank you guys so much for watching. And have a great rest of your day. Okay, bye.